Good morning, St. Pius. I'm Michael Morgan. And I'm Marcus Merriman. And you're watching The X Factor. Today we're on a Wednesday block schedule. Today's saint of the day is Brother Juniper, servant of God. We don't know much about Juniper before he joined the friars in 1210. Francis sent him to establish places for the friars in Gualdo, Tadino, and Vetturbino. When St. Clair was dying, Juniper consoled her. He was devoted to the passion of Jesus and was known for his simplicity. Mom. That was a fresh saint, very simple. Mr. Murphy needs an A-plus student immediately for math tutoring outside of the school, so if you're good at math and like Mr. Murphy, go do that. Attention St. Patrick and St. Andrew's graduates. These schools are in need of some students to attend activities during Catholic Schools Week. If you are interested, please see Mrs. Martin in the office. Creekside Baseball is now hiring gate workers, field managers, maintenance crew members, and students interested in summer internships. All applicants must be at least 16 years old and, ha and have open availability over summer. Pay will begin at 10 to 13 per hour. The positions are great for high school slash college students, teachers, assistant coaches, or anyone looking for an extra part-time job. So if you're interested, email jackson.brett at creeksidebaseball.com. So if you want to make some extra money, email them. Again this year, SPX is hosting a carnival during the grade school basketball games on Saturday, February 1st. Students will help with car running carnival games. The carnival is Saturday, February 2nd at SPX in the Commons. The first shift, 8.30 a.m. to 10.30 a.m. and the second shift, 10.30 a.m. to 1 p.m. Please see Mrs. Little in the front office to sign up. Yeah, so help out the community. Will be there. Anyone interested in playing for the SBX men's tennis team, there will be an informational meeting on Thursday in Coach Thornburg's room, 155 after school. Yeah, cool. tennis. Cool. Elizabeth Spielman Healthcare Scholarship applications are due Friday to Mr. Murphy, January 31st. Today's story of the day is girls basketball with me and Marcus. Oh, God. I'm Michael Morgan. I'm Marcus Merriman. And this is this week's story on girls basketball. What are your goals for this season? Uh, I would say, um, obviously, having a winning season is a good goal. Um, and to advance farther than we did last year in postseason. And then can we have a prediction for this postseason? I think if we perform the way I think we can perform um, and use our depth wisely. Um, I think we can make it farther than we did last year, which would mean Final Four. Cool. What is your favorite part of the team? Uh, Miss, Miss Daniels. <laughs> what are your goals for the rest of the season? Uh, to beat uh, Serena Sundown and to go to state. That was this week's story on girls basketball. Now back to you. Um, that was a great story. You know how good that story was? Yeah, it's good enough to give me a C minus. <laughs> <laughs> There's no uh, sports here today. Today's lunch is fajita chicken bowl. There's no birthdays either, so Ooh. geez, it's a rough, rough day. Rough day. Well, sadly, that is all the announcements we have for today, but that's okay because we will see you tomorrow. Catch you on the flip side. He won't do it though. <laughs>